Oh god. <laughs> the budget on this sucks. Take one. Roll them. <laughs> Hello. Hello, children. Um, so here's the thing. We know how much we're really missing you guys, but we also know that you miss us a million times more. That's not true. It's I true. miss you guys so much. I know you think about me every waking moment. Like I think of you. So we decided to end your misery. We decided to have just a little bit of fun and connect with you guys. And we're gonna do it in Miss Howler's Zoo. Uh, oh, this is Ducey. Do Seuss. This is Bella. This is Bella. Oh, and I don't know if you can see this one. This one's Bo. And they're gonna be helping us teach you from home. Yeah. So it's you're, be so you're welcome. We hope you love it, and we're very grateful that we get to be your teachers. We know that you're going to be so excited to see our faces on a regular basis again. And we would love for you to send your faces to us somehow. Yeah, via email, the Remind app. You can drop a comment in our uh, comment section because we're YouTubers now. I don't know how to do that, but I, I'm assuming you guys do. You guys are going to be great. Yeah. It's Yay! Be so good. Okay, so thanks stay for watching. Tuned. Here we go, guys. Woo! <laughs> Hello. So, to start with, we're just gonna teach you a math game that you can play with cards. And we creatively named this Power Products. Ooh. Um, actually, it's an everyday math game from a million years Shh. ago. Ours. Hashtag. Pay us money. Okay. Anyway, shuffle like a pro. If you can't shuffle, put them in a pile face down. Okay, stir them up. Cards. Um, the cards are your factors as you lay them down. But then you're going to multiply them or put them together and then it's going to become your product. So start with, doesn't matter how many cards you start with. Start with 8, start with 10, start with 16, start with 52. However you want to do it. Lay them face down on the floor. Lay them how? Face down on the floor. So we're going to start with 12. I don't know why 12. 12. And you rock, paper, scissors to see who gets to go first. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Rock, paper, scissors, shoot. Oh, you get to go first. So Miss Wood is going to flip over two guards. <laughs> two guards. I flipped over, what is it? A three and a four. Those are your factors. What is the product? Three times four is 12. Nice job. I draw two cards. Factors. Can an ace be high or low? It's high. High. 11. 11. Ace 11, is 11. Times 6 is 66. So my product is 66, which completely squashes her product. So I get to keep her cards and my cards. And that's how you keep score. Next one. 5 times 4 is 20. Your factors were 5 times 4. Ooh, what is it called? That property when you flip flop it? <gasps> Commutative property. The order doesn't matter. The product is the same. It works with addition. It works That's with multiplication. multiplication. Okay. What did you have? Oh, 20. 20. 6 times 2 is 12. Squash! She's so humble. Five times seven is 35. Nice, thank you. I've been practicing. So should I say the wrong product and you catch it, I get the cards. Mm -hmm. Kings are 10 times three. 27. Nope, not quite. Oh, 30. Man! Game over. Count your cards. One, two, three, four. You won. Nice 
nice job. Nice job. Thanks for playing with me. Nice job. Okay. Game two. So, this is Speedy Speedster Speed Math. Speedy, speedy Speedster Speed Math. Such a great name. Okay. Rolls off the tip of the tongue. This <laughs> came to me. <laughs> speedy Speedster Speed Math. Okay. Yep. Um, you can do it with multiplication. You can do it with addition. If you wanted to challenge yourself, we'll show you some challenge options. Hold on. So we're going to start Stay with tuned. multiplication. That's another episode. Yeah. Okay. So shuffling like a pro, like the poker pro I am. Good. Good. Enough. She's a real card shark. Yep. Okay. Is that figurative language I just used? Oh, because am I a card shark? <laughs> I think that's an idiom. Extra credit if you commented that and knew it. They can't you, comment it yet because they haven't watched it yet. I'll give you a four in the grade book. No, I'll give you a four in the grade book. I'll give you two fours. I'll give you a five. Okay, anyway, lay down the cards. No, no, you don't lay the cards for no, this way. No, no. You keep them in a pile. So they're in a pile on the floor. Two piles on the floor, one for Miss Wood, one for me. We're gonna flip at the same time. And whoever says the product first is a speedy speedster. And they get both cards. Product master. Okay, ready? 40! Oh, yes! Ready? Go. Two twin! <laughs> tie. That was a tie. Then ties go in the middle. In the middle. Then whoever wins the next one gets, gets it. all. challenge yourself and see how well you know your own multiplication facts. Mm -hmm. And if you want to really challenge yourself, you can make aces 11 and you can make kings 12 mm -hmm. and queens, jacks, and tens all tens if you wanted to. Live your best life. This is, this is your choice, guys. We just want to make sure that you do you. Yeah. You're having the best little quarantine time. I love you. I miss you. I know you miss me. I love you. Do you miss seeing my face every day? <laughs> I love you. Take two. Okay, we just came up with this one kind of just super fast. Um, but because you may be, well, you are inside, especially now on this day. So for fresh air on this day would still be a good idea. Yeah, go outside. Don't yeah. wear a coat. You don't at recess anyway. Wear a coat. <laughs> we'll cut that. <laughs> We're not for the love. They don't. I know. Parents, your kids don't wear coats, and it's not because we don't tell them to. Yeah, we nag them. I'm sorry, children, that I just ratted you out. Yeah, you nag your children. Okay, so, shuffling, same idea. You are going to attach a movement to the product. But here's the thing. If you're 50 and you get a product of, like, 80, there's not any way that I'm going to do 80 of something, so I'm going to figure out a way to make it work, Okay. So shuffling again. I'm young and I'm not doing 80 of anything. So if you're doing this by yourself, obviously you're just going to attach your own movement to it. But I will pick two cards in the factor and then you have to tell me what exercise I have to do to... Okay, deal. Okay, so my factors are three and four and the product of three and four is 12. 
you have to do 12 too slow <laughs> now you have to do it you have to do 12 i couldn't think of anything push-ups no i can't even do one push you have to do 12 crunches okay 12 squats oh i'll I do really squats. like exercise okay i'll do 12 squats okay ready okay you guys can't even see me from the waist down, can you? She's so tall. So, one, two, three. Get it. Fast forward. Four. Twelve. You get the idea. There we go. Twelve. Okay. Okay, my turn. Seven times ten. Oh, that's seventy. Seventy would be a lot. So, think of ways you could skip count to get to seventy. So, Miss Wood. What mul What are the multiples of 70? I don't, is it multiples? Oh, Kirshner, if you're watching this, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, we're trying our best. Yeah, we're trying it's our hardest. Been, it's been a long time since we've been in school. <laughs> it's been like four days, a very long time. So, I'm gonna count by seven. Does that make sense? Okay, Miss Heller, I'm gonna count by sevens until I get to 70, and that'll be my exercise. Okay, what's my exercise? Um, your exercise is jumping jacks. Go. She's better Ready? attitude. Okay. I'm gonna count by sevens. Go! Seven, 14, 21, 28, 35, 42, 49, 56, 63, 70, 70, 70. Woo! Crushed it! Nailed it! Yeah! Okay, you get the idea, right? Movement math. Movement math. Get you moving, because you can't be outside because it's cold. You know what though? Fresh air is fresh air. We've been inside a while. I think for I think it's time for a fresh air break, honestly. Honestly. Fresh air okay. break. Here we, Here we go. Before you go outside in this inclement weather, it's important that you have the proper attire. Yeah, you don't want to go outside in slippers. <laughs> that would be dumb. Or capris. That would also be done. Oh, my cat is too fat. <laughs> <laughs> you get the idea. Let's go. Fresh air. Fresh air break. Fresh air break. Uh. Hi, hey. Spill your tea. Chapter 7. Students are never recommended to cook unsupervised. It may result in proprietal or physical damages done to self and family members. All right, Michelle, tell everybody what you're doing today. Let's make it so wedding <laughs> Are you crying tears of joy for the bride and groom? Um, yeah. Well, go look in the garbage can. Take your dumb camera and go direct it in the garbage can. Well, first let's look at the floor. Shut up. <laughs> oh no. Let's be in the garbage can. Oh, the mixer that you broke. That you just it. bought. I burnt it up. <laughs> Burns just because it's brand new and never been used before. That doesn't matter. These are gonna be so good. You're gonna make the bride and groom so happy. Thanks. <laughs> They're gonna be so appreciative. Thanks. <laughs> Shut up. Thank you for tuning in to this edition of Wise Words with Miss Wood.
I get the camera's over here, so look right there. I really struggle with that. Because right, right here, Michelle. Look, look there. Hi, Hi guys. guys. <laughs> <laughs> I keep looking at the red dot. Don't look at the red dot. I'm gonna say goodbye. And I am too. Miss Wood. No, I'm like <laughs> literally because look at it. Looks like my eyes are wonky. <laughs> Just look right there. I can't fix it. Oh, I, I love mean, you guys. I miss you. I'm gonna leave. <laughs> She's gonna tell you what to do. Oh, yeah. Okay, guys, so our plan for this entire adventure is for us to just upload YouTube videos, hopefully daily if we can figure it out. It may not be daily, but you guys can subscribe to our YouTube channel and you can comment in the link below in the comment section. And we want to know what you guys want to see. So if you want us to teach you a lesson on fractions or division or um, some kind of game around those things, let us know in the comments what you guys want to see. Um, also, you can leave fun comments about what you guys have been doing over the quarantine break. We are your corn teachers, and we love you, and we miss you. Oh, also, <laughs> look at the dot, Michelle. Oh, I have my no, oh, not my that dot. <laughs> this one. Also, <laughs> put your sunglasses on. In all honesty, this is such a serious time, and we do truly love and miss you guys like crazy. I can't look at my hair. Oh, I look I like I, I look like I've been through a quarantine. I look like I look every day with my kids. <laughs> Like a Me hot mess. Anyway, Bye. I can't. I'm going to look this way. Um, <laughs> I love you guys. I don't know. That's why I can't take selfies. It's because I can't. I don't know where to look. And then all the training in the world. If you want to see a video of Miss Howard trying to take selfies, let us know. Okay. Mm -hmm. Or Miss Wood trying to teach me how to take one. Also, we took a door off the fridge today. Yeah, we did. And we fixed the refrigerator we today. Fixed it. Yeah. They have to order one more part. Yeah, but we, uh, we took the refrigerator apart. We knew righty so. tiny lefty Lucy. Yeah, we did. All right. Love you guys. Love you. Bye. Do this. Wise words with Miss Wood. Take two. <laughs> Deuce, you could try to be useful. You could try to be better. Oh, I'm gonna hold that for a second. Good was so wise. Is this recording? Oh, it's recording. Wise words with Miss Wood. Michelle, that says illiteration. Oh. Illiteration means I can't read. Marker, roll them. Oh, take two. It broke already. The budget sucks. I wish you would quit saying that word. Power products. Take one. Take one. Lately, I've been, I've been thinking, I want you to be happier, I 